Autumn, the most cozy season, full of gorgeous warm colors of red, gold, and yellow. The abundance of mushrooms and rose hips and acorns and pine cones. Rain on window panes, gray, cloudy skies, pumpkins and hot drinks. I could go on and on. As much as I love every season, and they each have a magic of their own, as I like to say, but autumn truly is my favorite. Everything about it sings to my melancholy soul, and I look forward to its arrival each year. There is something so nostalgic that comes from the autumn months. Comforting memories from childhood revisit me, and I just feel at home during this season. There are so many things to do and enjoy as well, so in this video I wanted to share 10 things you might be inspired to do this autumn season. Of course, they are all very nature-centered, and of course, nothing but cozy. I hope you will enjoy and find something to add to your own autumn bucket list this year. Number one. Take a walk in a nature park or in your own neighborhood and observe and enjoy the seasonal flora and fauna. If you've seen my other videos in this series, one of my favorite things to do each season is taking long nature walks and observing the beautiful changes in nature. Fall is one of my favorites as the colors begin to change to these bright and beautiful warm colors. Leaves begin to fall off the trees, and there's a crisp chilliness in the air, and there are so many things to find, and perhaps collect along the way. I always love finding fallen acorns, or leaves, or pine cones to take with me as treasures for my studio or to decorate my home with. one of the most simplest of things to do, but if you go out with intention and awareness, walks in nature can be pure magic. Number two, create a cozy atmosphere in your home. Another one of my favorite things to do this time of year is make my home as cozy as possible with autumnal smelling candles, beeswax tapers, low and warm lighting with lamps and fairy lights, and of course, a bit of cozy autumn decor. Being intentional with your space can be a huge way to create peace and a place that you love being in and spending your time in. Especially if the weather begins to make it not so friendly or easy to be outside. Making your space warm and inviting will make it that much more enjoyable when staying at home.
Number three, visit a bookstore and enjoy some cozy reading. When I think of autumn, I often think of books and cozy afternoons reading by an open window with the sound of rain falling outside. Autumn is the coziest time to dig into a good book, and another incredibly enjoyable activity is wandering about a local bookstore. There are endless possibilities and stories out there to be read, and even if you don't buy anything, the atmosphere at a bookstore can be so warm and inviting, and is just another great way to get out of the house if the weather isn't the best. Once you've found a story you'd like to get lost in, take your book and create an inviting space to just get lost. Whether that be indoors or outdoors, just spend some time getting lost in the world of the book that you're reading. Number four, stay at home and make some autumnal crafts. One of my favorite things to do is follow a little candle making kit. These are so fun and super simple to do, and at the end, you have a perfect stash of taper candles to use throughout the season. There are also so many fun and beautiful crafts you can make with the items you collected from a seasonal walk. A couple years ago, I made these twig and maple seed dragonflies. You can also make autumn leaf butterflies, garlands, and so much more. Number five, plein air paint or sketch outside. If you'd like to draw or paint, another wonderful activity, if weather allows, is to take some supplies outside and enjoy painting or sketching in the open air. Paint the landscape around you. This is a wonderful way to practice mindfulness and being in the present moment by observing your surroundings and focusing on the colors, objects, shapes, and sights around you and translating that into a creative piece of art. This is one of my favorite things to do and something I highly encourage you to try. Number six, go mushroom hunting. Exploring outdoors or going on a hike to look for different varieties of mushrooms can be so much fun. I do want to preface that if you do go on a mushroom hunt, only go to look and observe them rather than harvest them unless you have a very specific purpose and have researched the kind of mushrooms you are harvesting. I often harvest them on my own family's cabin property to preserve and use as decor in my home or for nature inspired crafts. It is just as much fun, if not more, just to go and see how many different varieties you might find on one single walk. Take pictures or take a little notebook and document them that way. Number seven. Bake autumnal treats or soups. I tend to do a lot of baking in the colder months, and so another wonderful activity to do is make autumn-inspired baked goods. A few I have made and have really enjoyed are pumpkin french toast, pumpkin cinnamon rolls, maple scones, and a berry crumble. I also love to make soups in the colder months as they are perfect to have on a cold and cozy day.
Number eight, preserve autumn leaves. Another fun nature-centered activity is to press or preserve colorful fall leaves to use as decoration or use for future crafts. Last year I experimented with preserving my collected fall leaves in wax and hung them up in my studio window and it was so beautiful to have a fall season. You can either just press your autumn leaves in a flower press or just a heavy book, or you might try to preserve them in beeswax too. Number nine, visit a pumpkin patch. Another very seasonal activity to do, at least here in the US, is go to a pumpkin patch. So many pop up during the autumn months and they can be so fun to visit. They often have tractor rides, corn mazes, apple picking orchards, fall inspired foods and sweets, and of course, a pumpkin patch to pick your very own pumpkins. The one I love going to each year has a you pick flower garden with late summer and early fall blooms, and so I usually come away with a gorgeous garden bouquet, a few pumpkins to decorate the porch, and maybe a sweet treat or two. Number 10, watch a cozy movie. Finally, one of the best things to do in fall is cozy on up in the evenings and watch a comforting fall movie. There are so many I love to watch during this time of year. I usually will turn on all the fairy lights, light a few candles, brew a steaming cup of tea, and enjoy a sweet treat while cozied up under the blankets while I watch a film. I would love to know your favorite autumn movies, so if you'd like to share down in the comments some of the films you watch every year during the autumn season, that would be so fun to see. Well, I hope you found some inspiration in these 10 ideas for fall. If you take away anything at all, I highly encourage you just to get outside at least once this autumn season and find the magic that is hiding all around us in the incredible beauty that is nature. You will walk away in awe and inspired by what you find. I hope you have the coziest of autumn seasons this year and wishing that magic finds its way to you, even in the smallest of ways.